<clears throat> what is up, you fermented fallopian fuckbirds? I'm McStud. And welcome to the motherfucking McStud show. We outside, it's late, but that's okay. Deuces. Technically, it's Tuesday. Cheers, bitches. Ah. Yeah, it's late. It's about, I guess I'm about 2.30 in the morning. Uh, been busy today. Did my first feature for NB2, NB2E's. Uh, I, I can't wait for that song to come out. Um, so that's fucking awesome. So that's a plus. I, I'm just uh, thrilled that someone would want to have me on their fucking track. Uh... And I can't wait for him to lay his verse down because I think it's going to be one hell of a motherfucking song. Uh, I shared the fucking uh, snippet to it a while back. I said it's going to be an instant classic. Uh, so I'm stoked for that. And tonight I've been working on some Bedroom Closet Mixtape 2 shit. Uh, this song is a special song. When I first heard when I was looking for uh, tracks or beats or whatever, I heard this one. It came with the hook, and I was like, I gotta have it. So it's perfect. A uh, little bit of storytelling, which is always good. Uh, so that's what I'm working on now. I've already got the first verse done and recorded. Um, got to write and record the second verse tonight, and then you know, fuck with the vocals a little bit, get it to sound the way I want it to fucking sound. Um, it'll probably be my last song that I release openly until the uh, album is done. Um, but that's what I plan on doing. When I got, I got this like a month or so ago, uh, but it's been kind of a crazy three weeks with the move and everything. Um, but yeah, cheers, bitches! I'm having a good night. I've had a good day. <clears throat> God damn. Hope you guys are having an amazing week so far. Like I said, this should be Monday's video, but it's technically early Tuesday morning. Uh, I'm in a whole different time zone too. So, I'm off an hour. And on top of that, my laptop is off an hour. I need to change the time, because I, I keep thinking it's an hour later than what it really is. Um, and I'm still adjusting to the uh, time difference. Like it gets, you know, the sunrise and sunsets like an hour off from what I'm used to. But yeah, it's been great. I hope you guys uh, have a great rest of the week. Whew. Man. Baby girl and I were talking earlier about some dumb shit. I can't remember what the fuck it was about. But it involved my motherfucking height. Oh, she kept calling me a motherfucking giant. I'm like, I'm not a giant. I'm average height. I'm an average height for a man. I'm six foot three. Uh, and she pops out with uh, some statistics saying that the average male is five foot nine or some shit. Uh, so I'm like, shit. No, I'm not far off. I'm 6'3", you know. It's only six inches. Literally, that's a whole fucking dick right there. I'm a whole dick taller than the average height. That's not that big of a deal. You know? It's like, I don't know. I mean, six inches, I'd rather, you know, if someone's going to come face to face with me, I'd rather them be a six inch dick length, dick length away from me. And like nose to nose because nose to nose is just bad news especially if they're running their cocksucker then they want to fucking spit and then they you know when you spit on someone that's just fighting right there like that's that's uh, first and foremost that's assault with bodily fluids and no one wants to be fucking spit on so i don't ever start shit that's always someone else to fucking start shit um but if you spit on me it's fucking on Because really, the only thing I spit on is your mother's pussy, because that's just dry. Uh, 
I only spit on her if she ain't got her lube, because sometimes she ain't stocked up. You know, she didn't jump on uh, some of these adult websites and order her lube properly. But she wants the dick, and I can't stick the dick in, because then it's like, it's like, uh, what's the best comparison for that? It's trying to, it's kind of like trying to take a, a snug, wet pair of pants off. You know how it's just like you just can't get them off, or you're trying to, you know, or trying to put your pants in, or your leg in, some fucking wet pants. It just don't fucking work. You got spit on that shit, which doesn't make sense. But I mean, when the vagina's dry, you can't just shove a fucking dick in. But I guess some some bitches probably like that shit. God damn it. Which is a whole fucking mess. Ugh. We've been watching a show called Working Women. And that's a whole fucking mess of a show too. Jesus Christ. I ain't never seen some train wrecks like that. It's my first outside video. I don't really know. People's outdoor routines. But I'm guessing that was like an AC unit kicking on. You hear them tree frogs? It's nice and peaceful out in this motherfucker. Oh, shit. I gotta, I've been taking breaks. Smoking, but then I was like, man, I just need a video break before I kick in the second verse. The third verse is actually the, the feature, and the, what I, I gotta figure out what this woman's name is. It's gotta be in the fucking contract that was sent to me, because I don't like to put out a song. Like, blame me. I don't know who that woman is on the fucking song. I need to. I, I wish I, she needs credit for it. Um, and this song, they need credit for it. I'm gonna have to contact. Nah. Like the person I'm making beats from is from Germany. Uh, he, he, he throws down some pretty cool ass fucking beats. And I'm hoping that's a bug. I don't know where that light's coming from. But that's different. But anyways. God damn it. I'm enjoying, uh, I don't know. Anyways, I'm confused, but I'm enjoying the, uh, little bit of free time before I go back to work, get to work on some music, get to relax, get to get settled in my new home. Um, it's been nothing less than amazing. Um, and baby girl's gonna be part of the fucking videos. Uh, she said to throw down on some fucking hooks and some fucking verses for me, which is amazing. I can't wait for that. But most of all, I just cannot wait to complete the uh, sequel to the bedroom closet mixtape because it's way different than the first way different um, but I think it's gonna be good and I hope you guys like it when you fucking hear it when it gets released um, it's just been kind of magical being able to put out fucking songs that are released uh, that people can hear, they can stream. You know, it's easier than the person would think, but not everyone has done that. That's just like, I guess it's an accomplishment for me, and I'm happy about that. I'm proud of it. <coughs> Excuse you, motherfuckers. Goddamn, cooter bugs. Fucking cooter bugs in your mama's ear. I'm excited to get this shit out. I'm trying to do as much work as I can on it before I uh, 
go back to work. But I've got one hell of a, uh, a supportive woman. Uh, she's amazing. I cannot wait to introduce you all to her on video. Um, we will get there. But anyways, motherfucker, I think my break is done. Well, we at? we at 10 minutes, almost 11. It's a nice little break. I, I just need some fucking malt liquor. Kick me into that uh next gear to uh, write this next verse, get it recorded. I just want to get it done. I actually got another track. I need to work on a fucking hook. Um, but I sent the NB2Es because I wanted him on that too. So I need to get on that and I have another track working on. Y'all heard pull up. Um, we're working on that. I guess there was a work on some work on that done today, which is awesome because I wasn't really sure where we're at on that. Um, but hey, any work is work. It's progress. Looking forward to uh, jumping into some open mics here in Missouri, like 30 minutes away from St. Louis. So, yeah. Anyways, motherfuckers, thanks for watching. About to get back to work. I'm a stud. I'll catch up with you later. Deuces in your mama's titty hole.